Well hello, uh, and in this glorious weather, uh, a very short video this week about using, uh, in this case, Canon FD lenses uh, on a Fuji x camera. Um, a couple of years ago I was very lucky to be given three Canon FD lenses. I was given a 50mm f1.8, a 135mm f3.5, that's this one, and a 35 to 70mm, um, not quite sure of the aperture and that thing, just a variable aperture, variable aperture lens. Um, and for a while, to be honest, they sat um, unused. Uh, I was also given a, a Canon film camera, but never really got round to sticking the roll of film in it and, and using it. Um, anyway, once I did, I discovered that these lenses are actually very good and I set about um, finding out if I could use them on my, by then, Fuji camera. Um, and I found out that you can, you can get an adapter for them. In fact, you can get the, uh, a number of adapters um, at varying price points. Um, to uh, adapt these lenses to Fuji X mount. Um, the adapters themselves are very simple. Um, I got one or two actually made by a company called uh, Best Troy or Best Coy, whatever it is. And I'll leave a link to the um, adapter um, in the description of the video below. Uh, it's not an affiliate link, I don't, I don't do anything like that. Um, you can get a number of mix. I think there's K and F Concept do some. Uh, there's these Best Choi ones. There's certainly some others. I think at around about the same price point, they're all pretty much the same. Uh, these cost me, I think it was fifteen pounds each, thirteen or fifteen pounds each. The K and F Concept ones are a little bit more expensive, but they are exactly the same. Um, they're all metal construction. So you've got the um, metal part there that attaches to the lens, and you've got the metal part there. It is metal. I know it looks plastic, but Trust me, it's metal uh, that attaches to your camera. Uh, very, very simple to use. There uh, is a red dot uh, on the adapter there. I don't know if that will focus. And obviously, of course, there's a red dot on your lens. You just line those up. And that's it. You have effectively a Fuji X-mount lens. Um, now there's a ring, it took me a while to work out what this ring does, but um, effectively it locks uh, the aperture so you can't change it. If, you, if it's in, strangely, the open position, if you turn it to lock, then you can use your aperture ring to change aperture. If it's in that position, open, you can still twirl the aperture ring but the aperture blades don't move, so you've got to make sure that it's in all the way that way to the, yeah, to the left. <laughs> anyway, um, this then obviously just mounts straight onto your camera. In exactly the same way that a Fuji X mount lens which you line up the dots. And that's it, on. Uh, so that's the physical side of using these adapters. Um, of course they are manual focus um, only. These lenses are manual focus anyway. Um, but there are no electrical contacts in these adapters. So they are, um, I forget what the word is, dead I guess. Um, they don't do anything. <laughs> Anyway, um, there are a couple of things you need to do on your camera uh, before you can start using them. You need to dive into your menu and go to the uh, camera icon and then go down to mount adapter setting and change lens 5 to the focal length of the lens you want to use. Um, I don't think this makes any difference exposure wise um, but what it will enable is that when you look at the EXIF data of your image uh, it will show the focal length of the, the lens you used. What you also need to do 
is go into AF MF menu and go into MF assist and set that to focus peaking and then you can choose between white, red or blue high or low lights to help with your focusing and most importantly you need to go into the wrench icon on your menu uh, and scroll down to button dial setting and then onto page two of that and make sure that shoot without lens is on uh, as i said this is a dead uh, adapter so there's no electrical feed between the adapter and your camera so it needs to know uh, that you're going to let it shoot without having a lens on because uh, effectively the camera thinks there's no lens mounted to it so make sure that's on and uh, and you're good to go um, the focus peaking on these Fuji XT cameras is fantastic it's really really easy to use and it's really really easy to uh, pick your focal point and uh, and snap onto that that focus really accurately um, these lenses I say I had mine given to me um, but they are quite uh, easily available on uh, eBay I would imagine or other sort of uh, uh, auction sites and uh, they're great fun to use um, the XT cameras are really retro in their design I know I've gone on about this before but um, that's one of the reasons why I love them so using them with these these old lenses is quite appropriate and they actually look quite nice mounted on the camera um, anyway uh, as I said just a quick video um, get out there and enjoy the warm weather and um, we'll see you again very very soon Pull the ripcord, the ship has lost its sail Your mama's got a new man, your daddy always fails and you